Hi guys and welcome to our brand new Disney vlog. We are so excited but before we get started we wanted to let you know that we have partnered up with Magic Breaks and we are so excited. Um, not only have I worked with them for over 10 years myself and there are many reasons. They've got amazing customer service, they have the best range of destinations all over the world and their team is only a phone call away so if you need them at any time you can get hold of them because I know in personal experience we've had to ring them from Florida and they've sorted stuff out very quickly. Now the best thing is the team can sort any magical trip to fit your budget. Now if you love the vlogs just as much as we love filming them, head over to the Magic Breaks website for our very own exclusive code DELAMAS for £25 off of your next holiday. So sit back, relax and if you enjoy it, start planning. Hi guys, so um bit of a boring day today. Bit of a boring day today, but what we did do the other day, we didn't vlog it, and I'm glad we didn't do it, but me and Carl went back to Universal to do what is it, Velociraptor, right? Velociraptor and Hagrid's. And Hagrid's ride, and wow, that's all I'm going to say. The Velociraptor ride is the best ride I've ever been on. It was unbelievable. It had corkscrews. It pushed you from 0 to 70 miles per hour twice in the ride. Um, and it was, yeah, epic. It was about 35 minute wait, but we waited about 20. It was really good. Really, really enjoyed it. I had a beer. Cara sat and had a beer. I went on with her brother. Thank God he was with us. Uh, so I could fill the adrenaline with someone. Um, and then we went on the Hagrid's ride after. And that, again, was one of the best rides I've ever been on. Gutted I couldn't show you. Also, in the Velociraptor ride, they've got like these two Velociraptors in these in this cage and they look so real thank god i didn't take forever with me because he would have pooped his pants because they look really real they breathe their eyes went they twitched it's brilliant um so 10 out of 10 that's the best ride i've been on it so far but hagrid was good oh this is the old bill look um hagrid was amazing um yeah it dropped you go so quick you're only strapped in halfway so yeah i'd say hagrid and uh, velociraptor were my best two rides and then after that we went to cowfish which was an amazing restaurant definitely would um advise book it, huh? book it, yeah you got to book it because it was an hour wait when we turned up but i had wagyu burger if you follow us on instagram you probably see me fall in love and make love to the burger it was amazing and then what did you have car I had sushi and Min Louis shared a burger because we're not greedy like you. But it just tasted amazing and I had a few beers as well so everything tastes 10 times better when you've had a few bevs. Um, but now today we've got like a chilled day but what we're going to do is... Well, no, so what we've done this morning is my mum's taking one of our cases back because they're leaving on Monday um, and that's when we're going over to Disney so she's going to take one of the cases back to make it a bit easier for us because she's got extra luggage. So we've packed our cases, I've done one what we need for Disney for five days and then one that has just got odds and sods in so hopefully mum skills we don't have to open all the cases. Um, so today everyone's back at the villa chilling me and Nath are going to go to Aldi and then Target and then maybe Walmart just to get some bits that we're going to need for the parks like snacks and things like that for the kids, water, you know, little things like that and I just want to go to Target because why not? So like I'm a massive fan of Walmart, the cake section is just incredible, I'm going to show you that. I'm going to get myself and me and Louis some boneless chicken wings for lunch because that's great. And also, someone messaged me, a Publix, they've got a chicken tender sub. Apparently, that's what all the Americans eat. It's supposed to be amazing. So I'd like to have one of them before I go. Um, but yeah, um, just uh, catching up on where we've been. So yeah, we're going to see Walmart. I'm going to show you all what you can get, the goodies in there. It's and Aldi, to show, because a lot of people oh, have been yeah. messaging me about Aldi, because Walmart is expensive. Like Shopping is really expensive out here now, but obviously there's an Aldi. We're in Davenport, and it's literally on International Drive. Um, is it cheaper? It's cheaper than like Walmart and that, but you can get, you know, like if you're staying here and you need to get like all your essentials, things like that, it's good for that. And like they do nappies that are cheaper and things like that. So boring mum time, but there is an Audi here. So go there, get 
your essentials and then go to like Walmart and they get your bits that you want. So yeah, not a overly exciting day, but I'm gonna make it as exciting as I can for you being in Walmart because if you're like a big kid like me and you like Chris sweets and- And Target. And Target as well, we're gonna vlog it all for you because I think it'll be quite fun. So yeah, hope you enjoy. So we are here, Cara's second home. She's very excited, she can't park properly. And um, yeah. Oh, bro, you ain't even driven out here, so I'd shut up. That's so true. Um, so yeah, we're gonna show you around Audi and see what you guys think. So first things first, is it bigger than the one would you say at home? It's about the same, isn't it? But it's all sort of the same. Not as exciting as Walmart, but you know, Walmart's just a um, shopping mall and steroids. It's got all your fruit and veg, just like normal at home. It actually looks very similar to the one at home. Yeah. See what car is getting our little nips into. What's that? We've got Ziploc bags at home, so I think they love gravy. Who likes gravy? What are we going to have with gravy? Raisins. Oh, raisins. I thought you said gravy. Right, so just to let you know how much um, Florida has gone up. These at home are 60p for a big pack. Now that is, how much were these? $4. Uh, yeah. $4 and something. So it's like a lot more money. But America has gone up in price. Obviously COVID and that's understandable. But yeah, it's not as cheap as it used to be because the pound ain't as strong either. Oh, these are another things like confetti muffins and that we don't get at home. Well, that's like 265. That's not too bad. But like... Full of sugar. They love that. Oh my god, they've got Twinkies. Do you think they like Twinkies? No. no? They look great. So do you think they have like the same stuff at home then, Carl? Like the brand, the brand stuff. That, that, that it's the same sort of stuff. Yeah, we can't tell. Oh, these are good. They're like, look, these cookies are. $5.28. Like, um, they are great, don't get me wrong. They're fantastic, but wow. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. Crisps. You're looking for a big pack. It's like $2.79. But they've got a great selection. <clears throat> what were them crisps we had the other day, Carl? They were superb. Oh my God, they look good. Butternut, butternut cookies with dark chocolate. Yeah. So yeah, it's very similar to the one at home. A little bit more pricey. Oh, so it is like it, and they do like the sort of knockoff version. So yeah, we normally eat, well, Pinky loves goldfish, but we got them for turtles. Hopefully, they normally do taste better, really. Oh, and these, they get these at home. Should we get them for, pit, um... oh, they're actually really nice. Should we just get them one pack? M&M, Snickers, Werther's Originals. Sea salted caramel. Oh look, so these these are the the knockoff version of um, Lucky Charms. I think Lucky Charms are like five dollars or seven dollars. I think these are one fifty five. I might get these and um, see what they taste like. But these, I think we got these last time, car. I might get these. So this is a massive game changer right here. All the kids have been screaming about is this apple juice so get your hands on this uh should we get them because it's less so yeah what they, they love the apple juice don't they get two packs yes and it's just bigger everything's a lot bigger out here like juice like that it's just normally half the size at home so, car is very excited this is the middle aisle so um sort of similar to the one you get at home but they've got yeah, some really good stuff actually. It looks less cheap than the stuff you get at home in the middle aisle. And I'm saying that as nice as possible. Um, but yeah, got like phone things. Oh, baby Sorry. section. How much are the nappies? Huh? The, the, so Cara reckons, go on. No, they've got the, come to here to get your nappies at the so how much cheaper, like, they might even put up dollars for one of these boxes. 
You heard it here first, guys. If you want to come and get nappies, you know, Lunch sometimes, you know, like a week month part, and you just take these and they can grab an even like this and get some. This is like their little wash and shampoo. Oh, it's only 187. One of them to take with us today. Yeah. Yeah. This is the wine section. This looks pretty cool. Looks like they've got some nice. I'm not a wine drinker myself, but the beers are good. They are quite cheap if you want to come out and get some beers. So they're like the non branded beers for the ones you get at home. That's eight dollars for six, and the wines range from about four to fourteen dollars. They've got quite a, a, a big selection, but yes, eight dollars for them. They look alright. It's American beer. Don't know if that flicks your switch. And all these up here, Vista Bay Hard Shelter Pack, right? The ones you get indoors, they're quite cheap as well. Five dollars. So the big bottles of water are three twenty nine. They have been a godsend because uh, they advise you not to drink the water out here. So definitely, definitely stock up here in Walmart. So go on, what you got? So we've got oranges, strawberries, we've got a little fridge in there. Strawberries, watermelon, chocolate bars, cookies, apple juice, buns, raisins, little crispy things. Because I've got them bags, so every day we can put things in the ticket bags, can't they? So we're stocking up for the Disney trip. Is, uh, the prices in, in Disney. Are oh, they just snacks? Like oh, yeah. They don't yeah, they don't, they, they're gannets, our children. So, yeah, are we done? Yeah. Off to Walmart. Mm -hmm. I'll show you this. If you love cookie dough as much as I am, they're the actual bits you can just snack on. Probably really not healthy for you, but um, for, yeah, they look, they are handsome. The ice cream's pretty good. They're lovely. Fat boys, sandwiches. Waffles. Wow, my mouth's watering now. Jesus. Them M&M &M bars, look, oh my, they look great. They look good. And them fat boys, look, the cookies and cream. Yeah, the ice cream selection in here is great. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that's a tip out, that's like 197. 197 for a massive tub, yeah. That's good. So that will come to $42.61. So about 35 pounds. So it's a little bit more expensive than the one at home, but is it a lot more? Yeah, man. Like I do a full week of shopping, 80, 90 quid with nappies, everything. So, yeah. Is it expensive out here, guys? It's just too warm. It is a little bit expensive. Don't want to put a downer on your holiday, no, but. But just being prepared, it's not like it used to be. Yeah, so that is Lidl down. Aldi. Aldi. Wow. Um, and we're on to Target. I I've never seen what's in Target. Car reckons it's impressive. But yeah, I'm going to show you around in Target. Next stop. Wow, this place is massive. Target. Huh? Cup holder in Target. Look at that. Starbucks. My God, this difference is huge. Oh my God, the oranges look so much better in here. They look a lot more greener, uh, orangey. Oh my god, sushi is great. Get some sushi. Yeah. So the sushi looks great here. I'm not gonna lie. Is this a lot more like Walmart? Is it? Is it more? Eleven bucks. Huh? Eleven bucks. Eleven bucks for a tray of sushi. And then you've got all salads here. Wow, them salads look great, I'm not gonna lie. Fruit and salad. Oh my god, look at the size of them sandwiches. Wow. Now we are talking. Look at that crispy chicken. <gasps> that looks incredible. What are these? Boneless, boning wings. Wow. Smells unbelievable. And this is what I'm talking about, the cake section. Buy your cakes there. Wow. I tell you what, I'd be in a lot of trouble if I moved to Florida. I'm putting weight on looking at this stuff. Look at it all. Oh my god, and donuts. Glazed donuts. Looks like it's been ransacked. Shrimp here, this is all your meat section. 
This is just unbelievable. Oh wow, look at that bit of meat. What's that Angus beef? Size of that. Wow. Wow, shapes, steaks. That's impressive, man. And it just goes on as far as I can see and the fruit looks great here and all. All salads, the salad looks amazing. It's a little bit more price here in here, but you get what you pay for. And if you're on holiday, treat yourself. You know what I mean? It's like the bakery section. Look at them. Oh my God, they look great. Raspberry Danish, cheese Danish, apple Danish, mini donuts. <gasps> they look great. Oh my God, cinnamon swell donuts. And they just look so moist and lovely. And then all your bread. Oh, more cakes. Oh wow. Look at this. Oh wow, that looks great. Iced raspberry lemon slice cake. Might have to get them. Cereal selection's pretty epic. Home favourite of mine, Pop-Tarts, they're great. 3 39 for bites of Pop-Tarts. You've got all your oatmeal. Special K. Lucky Charms. How much are Lucky Charms in here? Oh, they're on sale for 3 79 Cookie Crisps. That is actually quite cheap. And then, in the same breath, muffins and cookies. <laughs> nice. I've had them before, the um, old cookie cups. Look at them, they look nice. Now, the creme of the creme. Every Oreo known to man. Carrot cake Oreo, you know. Birthday <laughs> cake. Wow. Mint. Got everything, every flavor of Oreo. I think they're fans of Oreos, they are. They look great and all up there. The nut of butter. Wow. Are they? Mm, all tea here. It's just so big. You've just got so many. Like you've got so. I oh know. There's so many different varieties to choose from. They've got cream cheese onion. Crispy sour cream onion. <laughs> oh man, they've got. Cheddar jalapeno, I bet they're great. Mm -hmm. Star Wars goldfish. Fancy one you are. Oh my god, look at all these bits. Look like de like they're really lunchables as far as the eye can see. Wow. Yeah. And then this is the crisp section. Wow. As far as the eye can see, popcorn. Oh wow. Sorry. Oh my god, they've got a few dips as well, look. That's it. Dips and chips and crisps and dips. This is all. Wow. Wow, She likes a bit of uh, spice, my wife. That was the crisp section. What was that for you? No, I can't eat crisps because I can't stop. Crisps are my thing, I ain't sweet, I'm going to So, this is the uh, premium chocolate aisle. What? Oh my god. What have you got? I'm going to get a big bar of it though because I really want to try that. Uh, M and M's. I think every flavour of M and M, if you can oh, even have flavours. Wow. Your mints, mint section. Oh, oh they got um, Galaxy. Sorry, Is that Galaxy? Um, Reese's. Raw. You got every Reese available. Mine's still car. What's that? Jerkies. Oh god. What are they? What is it? Like skin? So we're going to look at the fro frozen section. Corn dogs. That's a bit of you know. Frozen corn dogs. Waffles. <gasps> yeah. Power flapjacks. Yeah. 
guys. Oh, they've got like English muffins. That is lovely. But I bet they don't taste as good as McDonald's though, but oh, you can just buy these out here. If you're a Disney person, you can actually buy Mickey bars in Target and it's seven dollars for six and I think they're about five dollars each in the park. Doggy desserts. Oh, we've got cookies and cream. <laughs> I look at all these mochi. I don't even know if I like mochi, but I know people don't. Vanilla, mango, double chocolate, cookies and cream. Oh my god, you've got pizza, snacks. It's just a lot. Oh my god, the Ben and Jerry section. No, these are vegan. Oh, are they? Yeah. I'm not judging, I'm just not vegan. Oh, this is nice. Oh, look at them. The chocolate chip layers. cookie dough. No, look at them there. So oh, sweet wow. cookie crumble, strawberry shortcake, salty caramel truffle. Yeah, hello. Mate, look at these pizzas. Alright. Yeah. That looks great, that full meat pizza. We should have got a pizza. Oh, I had one the other day, actually. It was really nice. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory coffee creamer. <gasps> Whipple scrumptious fudgy caramel ice bit. Are you getting it? No. Oh, yeah. Cold brew black coffee there. The milk section and eggs and nothing that exciting now. Just eggs, cream. But it's, you can just see how big this place is. All the mums out there. Carl wants to show you. And what was it in? What $26 there? That's not too bad. 18. And what was it in Lidl's? 10? Yeah. They got 136 in it to be fair, but 42 dollars. 136 that's a lot of nappies so it's still ten dollars is still better which if you're on holiday what's the ones delilah's been they were right now she's not um, but she ain't been soaking through or anything is she no but we bought a lot of Audi ones with us in there yeah but like yeah just if you can find Audi in your new Audi and your kids are happy with Audi ones i know some mums they're sensitive and they might be special ones, but... That's a nappy section and half, that is. But look, like, this is what I think we've got to lie. We just got like the own brand ones in Walmart or Publix and they've been fine. Like, look, 148 for 22. It's still a lot, but that's going to do you the whole holiday, isn't it? Yep. Huge baby section. Car seats, if you're stuck without a car seat. I think they do everything in here. I'm not even joking. Oh, my God. I love these. Oh, I think they are the best thing. Oh wow, they're ever. cool, yeah. I would love to have one of Yeah, well, it's, it's so big out here, you can get away with it out here at home. It's a lot smaller. All oh, your baby... Yeah, this is crazy. And they've got prams and everything. Wow. Target. Oh my god, yeah, that's jokes. That'd be great for the parks, wouldn't it? And it's Jeep. Did they not? Too big. Yeah, I didn't know it was made by shirt. Jeep. Oh, and also just to show people, so if you've got a kid like Freddie who's a bit bigger, um, but you haven't bought my pram, you can buy these in most supermarkets. They do a Mickey one as well, and they're like thirty dollars, which is cheaper than renting one at Disney. So if you come and you haven't got a pram, you think, oh my gosh, my kid needs a pram. These are great. They don't fold back or anything, but they're just good to. You throw away ones yeah. if you yeah. if you're thinking about bringing your kids to Target, don't because the toy section is crazy. Fred would be hanging off of everything. Look, they've got the Lego bits, all for babies, and that is just goes on as far as I can see. All your Disney toys, Barbie. Oh my God, they do absolutely everything here. Good thing we didn't bring Fred in it, because yeah. uh, that that. Trolley would have been full of tut. We love food. So uh, yeah. The target's quite and Walmart has it also. Oh god, she's found something for Pinky. Look, here we go. Here we go. So these are the sun creams we're using, and you don't have to rub them in. You just spray them on. It just if you've got two wiggly worms like us. But don't let you cream them up. These are the ones you just you spray it on just them. Grab it and just... Spray them and it keeps them well. They're not been burnt yet, so 
These are good. Do you think it's worth getting a free pack? Yeah, get a free pack. So now we're hitting the home place. Oh my God, look, Nerf guns a lot. Jurassic Park. Yeah, it's just like a, a shoot. Oh, Hot Wheels. Yeah, don't bring your kid here. I'd come with that. Oh my God, and look at the Lego section. Oh, it's group. How can I describe this place? It's like macros on steroids. Little baseball bats, look how cool they are. They're quite, they're not hollow. Um, yeah, I do need some pants actually. Cool, blimey, look at them. They're like diapers. So we've got, you've actually got Levi's in here as well, so you can buy like jeans and everything like that. <laughs> And the jeans are actually really nice. Yeah, they're nice, I like them. The jeans are lovely, you know. Oh my God, how much would you pay me to wear that to the one of the parks? Wow. That's a statement, isn't it? This is all the clobber, the clothes. Look at that chair, she would love that chair. That goes so well in her room and oh, all, wouldn't it? she'd love that. Pinky's chair. Oh, man. How'd you feel? Do you want to just move out here? I said you listen to America. No, no, look at all that. Me. Lamps. Oh, man, I've come in. It just goes off in here. This is like Dunhill. It's Dunhill, but it's got a, a grocery store with it as well. It's nuts. And then we've just, we've even gone past like um, an electrical place and we ain't even like TVs and everything like that, we ain't even seen. This is something we don't get at home. A piñata. Can you get them at home? You get a stick and you can put sweets in there for the kids. And they whack them on all the sweets or money. You're doing like a mermaid party. Look, they've got plates, everything. Stationary kit. <laughs> wow, though. Oh look, now Cara is, uh, I know why she's come around this side. No, I actually thought we've got matching Disney tops for one Have night. I got it? Yeah. Huh. Don't worry about that, Ethan. If you look cheaper, they're like seven, I don't like that top, but it's like seven dollars. A lot cheaper than the parks. And they've got that costume. They've got a lot of merch here, haven't they, Cara? Yeah, we, have, we got those the other year, didn't we? Yeah, my mum and dad put them on. She, she was a good sport, my mum. Well, she put she it. wore it with a smile. Well, yeah. That's cool. Grandma, granddad, why don't you get one? You haven't got one. You said you got me one. Yeah, but I'm saying you haven't got one. No, you get that. It's a goofy. That's one for Delilah. That one. Oh, when did she be able to kick them on? Definitely not. What they've got the elastic around the back. They're cute, but I don't know if she would. And there's all your flasks for the parks. They're cool. You can get. I see a lady with one the other day because it's like 30 odd degrees over at the Wait, minute. Do you know how expensive they are in the park? <clears throat> $8 here, $9. Dollars. And Target obviously have their own liquor section. That's the size of a little at home in there. Just all their booze. So yeah. Wow. I won't go in there because I can't be tempted, but as you can see. That guy, yeah, he's the size of a, a co-op or something indoors just for the liquor. It just shows you the size of this place. We had a really nice man called Sonny. Um, How convenient that Nathan's Apple Pay didn't work because it was over $100. Oh my God, there's a pizza yeah. Pe yeah, this is what I was going to show him. Right. And if it didn't get any better than that, you can have a pizza up while you go. So that was our trip. We weren't as exciting as the parks, but if you're coming out here and you want to know I'm where really to shop. I'm really wanted my red and my Cheetos. Yeah, I'm not driving out here, man. I ain't got the bottle yet. He's, got, he's on the car, but you just won't do it. Oh, I'm not being rude or lazy. I just don't want to kill anyone, because yeah, I will. I've only been driving for two years. Being a fanny so you can drink beer. But, um, Lidl, we, we was going to go... We don't go to Lidl. There's no Lidl. I mean, Aldi. Um, we was going to go to Walmart, but I don't... I know it's all the way to Walmart. Because they, they do boneless chicken wings. Yeah, it's so I'm good. I drive past our house to go back to Walmart. So, um, yeah, Target was impressive, like, really impressive. We've got some, uh, yeah, it looks like it's a lot more, um, 
it's, it's like a it's more of a see like walmart is like um like uh, yeah walmart's in asda and then like target's more of a should we say like a marks and spencers well, more like a Sainsbury's and then you've got Publix which is like Marks and Spencer's like but Waitrose and Marks is so you're going to be paying them sort of prices but you get what you pay for and the food is amazing um, and I do need to try them t chicken tender sub it's supposed to be an epic but yeah um, that was our fun day out at um, Aldi and Target we're not going to go Walmart we don't need to but yeah